Well, today is day uh, two of the Teach Thought of Logification Challenge with Reflective Teaching. And as you can see, I forgot the flip cam at school. So instead of the joys of 480p, which, okay, now you get 240p because I bought a webcam like forever years ago and it's not very good. So there and this one ironically is uh, what technology I want to use in my classroom and what like benefits I plan to reap or hope to reap from that ed tech integration um, this one's actually a little challenging for me you know other than you know there's better versions of things I already use like a nice webcam or a high def like 720p like camera or a GoPro or something like that um, I pretty much use like almost all the tech I could think of ever using in my class um, like I said in the other vlog I do a flipped classroom and I mean, I could I could do a whole vlog. I should do a whole vlog on just an introduction to what that means. Although other people have done it better, so I'm sure there'll be stuff in the suggested videos. Since I said flipping a couple times, or check out hashtag flip class chat on uh, Monday nights on Twitter. They've got tons of awesome stuff. But some of the technology I already use in my classroom. Um, I have a smart board. I don't use it a whole lot when I lecture because I don't like lecturing live with it. But I use it a lot when I record my videos. Use Camtasia to capture everything behind me, and then the smart board is nice because I can, you know, write on it and it captures all that. I do uh, like a picture-in-picture -picture type thing, so I'm still in there, standing in front of it. Uh, I use Adobe Premiere Pro and Camtasia editing software to sort of piece all that together. Um, I have Wi-Fi in my classroom which is awesome I know not everybody uh, has an opportunity for that so but that lets me do uh, like a BYOT with my kids which I like to call bring your own toys so any like laptops or tablets or even like their phones they can bring those in if it's internet capable phone and they can use that like a learning tool in the classroom uh, they can use it for research we have a class set of flip cams there's six of those that uh, Mrs. Bonnie Schutte got from a really cool grant and some money donated by some uh, Mount Vernon a former alumni well, I guess you don't really be a former alumni so just be Mount Vernon alumni um, so I can actually have the kids record their own projects and use that uh, as another tool in class um, I've done like uh, Google Hangout for days when like I can't be in like I have a personal day but there's a really hard lab or something that I really think I need to be there to help the kids with um, or even like FaceTime and Google Hangout type things for like kids who are absent but they're absent because like you know they had like a medical checkup or they're contagious but they still feel like ready to go and they don't want to get behind because that's right my kids are awesome and they'll do stuff like that and so that can get kids who aren't even there in the classroom so I guess um, I'm gonna open out to you guys those of you who watch it um, you know what ed tech type things do you think I'm uh, lacking out of my classroom I think later on in the week you get to see a picture of my classroom so maybe I'll video around the classroom and we can you know help you get a better idea of what I'm working with but you know what sorts of things do you think like oh man it'd be so much better if he had this or like this tool is what he should really be using to help him out with all that stuff because I mean right now like we've we've got Google Apps I use Dropbox I mean I've got I've got all kinds of stuff going on and I don't I don't know what I don't know what else like what joys of technology I could be missing so let me know in uh, the comments or in a video response down below what am I missing out on Thanks for watching.